Hello, my name is Dante Rene, and welcome to the 10 Room Bizarro YouTube page where I talk about films that I believe need to be talked about more. Like tonight's film, this is 1976's The Mothers. Now, this is also on DVD from Vinegar Syndrome, but I have it on Blu ray through the five years, uh, five, five films, five years uh, horror and exploitation volume two Blu ray set. The Mothers, directed by Sirio Santiago, I hope I have that correct, 1976, and it's 83 minutes long. Let's get into this, um, this wild, supercharged, beautiful definition of exploitation and beauty, and one in the same as well. I have some notes here on the mother, so you will see my eyes divert. Let's get into this movie, because if you are a fan of exploitation cinema in any way, you probably might, you probably have not heard of this film, number one. Number two, you need to see this film. Let's go. Women in prison, pirates, vengeance, the justice system. Gun battles, martial arts, rope swinging, like Tarzan, jungle bridges, hanging by hair, blood, boobs, family anger, double crossing, anti heroes. Everyone is bad in the film, but bad is good as well, for some. Who do you side with? Latino and black exploitation, wars and rape, the mothers, and so much more. This was quite a surprise uh, film for me uh, from the cover art and from um, just the name of the film. I thought this was gonna be kind of a badass, uh, badass girl type of film. Uh, exploitation film and it is that but it is it's rich it's complex there's a lot to it when we look at the music for the film we got funk we got atmospheric laid back dark scary even percussive and Latino vibes we got quick edits in this film. There are some lightning quick edits in this film. Beautiful locations that could, I mean, you know, they could be photographs. We're on sea, in a boat, in a jungle. Sucker punch out, outrageous fight scene choreography in the mothers. Wild fight scenes that come, that are just, exploitation gold they're not boring at all you, you see these fight scenes and you think my gosh the you know the billion dollar hollywood film fight scenes are trash compared to the fight scenes in this trash and i say that as a positive of course trash freeze frames Opening title using a written title and something that's already established in the shot for the title card. It reminded me a bit of Carlos Tobolina. I forget the film. Maybe it was Fantastic Orgy. I don't remember, but there was a film um, where he would use as the title card the actual movie poster just by filming it and, and running the camera around it. We kind of have a title card in this particular film that utilizes... Um, something that's already established in the in the in the scene of the movie itself. It's pretty pretty damn cool. We have wildly insane dialogue, exploitation dialogue in this film. If you love that type of dialogue, you're gonna love the mothers. No bra with a gun. Latin Latino and black exploitation worlds with women in prison as i mentioned the movie starts and you think you understand you think you get where it's going but you don't it keeps moving into different areas tough females and this is a film that toughness of the lead female characters in this film 
moves not just as characters, but also as the overall energy of the movie. A tough energy. This movie, apart from tough energy, is energy. It is stamina. Not just in fighting and action, but in personalities, focus, and dialogue. The storyline is actually quite complex in this film, as I mentioned. There are a lot of twists and turns with this storyline. You are mashing up a lot of worlds in here, uh, cinematic worlds, and you are getting a lot of characters, a lot of... Um, A lot of introductions of characters, a lot of turning points and tension as well in here. When this movie starts, the first five minutes of the film, you're going to be kind of blown away. Uh, you're not going to exactly know what the hell was going on. And in the beginning of the film, basically, it starts and you think you understand something maybe. And then something else happens and you're like, whoa, okay, wait a minute. That just redefined who I thought these people were. And then something else happens and the movie just continues. You almost feel at times in The Mothers that, oh, okay, this could be the whole film now, but the film doesn't stay there. It moves and pulsates into other areas. And boy, we even have the themes of the government in this film. Faith in the government, distrust in the government. It's here in The Mothers as well. And it really also has you question much good versus evil and black and white and is that really the way reality is at all? This is 1976's The Mothers. They said it was done by a one-man exploitation filmmaking machine, Sirio Santiago. High-octane female-led action classic. Whoa. Yes, indeed, folks. The Mothers. Thank you so much for watching the 10 Room Bizarro YouTube page where I talk about films that I believe need to be talked about more, like The Mothers. Thank you so much for watching, and please feel free to check out my own personally made films at youtube.com slash poopy, P-O-O-P-Y, diarrhea. Thank you so much, and good night.